Sorkar Jilla Langba Katanati Lekai Negasni Kasantrik Urampang Arajar Arpusau Kalapun Kuburam Yakishi Hajar Shispa Sapomut Kirang Mutkite Lekai Kibalawanra Nambat Burum Yakajilla Haki Jingilakai Gibapair Bapair Yakini Kinongilakai Sorkar Kala Ai Dakasong Pisa Katanati Lekai Jungajilla Kalapalong Yakini Ka Program Bakarpang Ha Ususotam Auditorium Shillong Ha kejeng don lang jong menteri rangba kejela ukon rat sangma kum ukong san u menteri ketena di leka yu ba shakliar warjri kum usumbot kong san ha kejeng don lang ru jong kitkot jong ka msoe ka director jong ketena sports and youth affairs jong ke surkar jela ke kong isa wanda bat kiwai kiwai ha kene kesengi ketena di leka yu kelapun kubur rom ru ya kinongi leka yu kebelah yuk bankur medal ha ka mekalaya games ka badang sudep sen ha nong ba turah Kabak kamp snow ternak cucu kalong bak sorkar kala pun kubur romru ya ke kenhun ya lekai football ke jela ke belawan ra ya ke enam kum ke ladu haka kilo india youth games arjar arpsau na ke liang ke sorkar kala pun kubur rom ya kini kirang ya lekai da ke song pisah. So I would like to thank all our guests and dignitaries. We have Frankie Bowman from East Kaziers District. Please come forward. Obadiah Kelpo, please come forward. After Taekwondo, we will move on to athletics. With the few winners from athletics, Joyful Narlong, Vibhoi. Linti Jikarmani, Southwest Kasi Hills. Marcus Ramsey, Southwest Kasi Hills. Primus Rogi from Ribhoi. Renaldi Dha, West Jantia. Uh, 900 athletes have won medals. So I would like to congratulate each and every one of you. I believe the 5th Meghalaya Games that was held in Tura was a huge success. But to make the 5th Meghalaya Games a huge success, it was a contribution of everyone, dedication, hard work and teamwork. And I believe without you, the athletes, adjusting to whatever the, the government had to prepare for you, I believe without the uh, dedication and hard work of all the associations and district administration, the 5th Meghalaya Games edition would have never been a success. But nonetheless, uh, it was a huge success and I'm very, very happy that we announced on the film Meghalaya Games that we will be distributing uh, cash awards to all the athletes who have won medals. And I just want to congratulate you, each and everyone. And I want to tell you one thing, especially all the athletes, that this is not the end. You have won medals, you have won, you, now you'll be receiving the cash awards. But then we should always have a mindset, set a goal, to achieve more and more, to achieve, to go to greater heights. And for that, to achieve all that, you have to work hard, you have to be dedicated. We, the government, are dedicated to work hand in hand with you, to provide you the best of the best so that you may achieve great things in life. So at the very outset, I would like to congratulate all the winners today and really wish you all the very best. You have made yourself your family and each and every one of us proud. So I think it would be appropriate that uh, let's give each other, in fact all of you, a huge round of applause. Many, many congratulations for the great achievements that we have achieved. That we would like to make you as icons and as motivation for other youth to be able to look at you and say that, well, I would like to be like them. And I would like to also be one of those people who are able to achieve. And hence, I would like to tell the youth who are here today that you have a very important and responsible role to play. Today, you might think that you just won a medal. But it's not about just the medal or the award that you will get. 
It is about the recognition that you're getting today in the state. It's about how your colleagues, your friends, other youth of the state today looking are looking up to you. Hence, I would request all of you that be that responsible person. Guide other youths. Tell them their your story of how you have done and achieved what you have achieved. That you will face challenges in life. But it is how you face them and how you improve and how you overcome them. That is really what matters. And I'm happy to see that the MSOA, the sports department and all the organizing committee members overcame many challenges and been making the games better and better every year. I really look forward to the games in Gente Hills in Jawai, which will be uh, in about a year's time. And I hope that all of you have started practicing for the event. We really hope that this year we had about 3,000 athletes. I'm hoping that we will be having many more in the next games, uh, hopefully maybe 4,000 to even 5,000 athletes participating in the future games to come. You will see that it is not just our speeches or the kind of words that we give, but in action, we have been able to invest in our youth. If you minus the infrastructures, which will be more than seven, eight hundred crores today in different infrastructures for the sport within this last five years, in the different programs, as I said, for grassroots music program, Yes Megalab program, Prime Entrepreneurship program, Northeast Olympics, different Megalab games, different association games. The government of Megalab has spent more than 100, 125 crores in different programs to organize and to mobilize the youth. And let me assure you that we will continue to do that and we will be investing in the youth because as mentioned by our Honorable Sports Minister, you are the future of our state and we want to give the best opportunity to you to be able to shine in whatever area that you have passion in and that you want to move forward in.